Hey guys, I'm here with Mr. Chuck Gov, and uh, he's a. You're playing around with your with the bases. Yes. Your bases. Yeah, actually, my uh, signature series uh, goes to production this year. I'm told. That's beautiful. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Well, the feather thing came from my tribe, uh, the Creek Nation. My uh, spirit animal is the hawk or the eagle. Same same word for both. So uh, they did all of it in the eagle feathers for me. They added one down here. Uh, it's a six string neck, block for five. Uh, so you have a wide grip oh, yeah. from front to top to bottom. Uh, they've been able to put it into production as an affordable, playable base, which was my goal. So, of course, it won't have this much inlay on, on the production line, but it will still be the same base. It is beautiful. Well, I, I love you. it. And it's, it's great because it's, it's right next to the two that are way more, you know, sure. clean. And this one just stands out. I like, won't. What, what would you say would be the difference between these two for somebody that wants to buy uh, one of your bases? Well, overall, totally, this is going to have, this is uh, more like a Rickenbacker, and it's going to have a different total value. Uh, I've, been, I've See how heavy it is. It's not bad, probably. Yeah, it's not heavy. Yeah. I mean, for the most part, you would buy this base because it's a completely different total value. There's a specific sound to a Rickenbacker, uh, and they found that and came out with their line of the Rickenbacker style. Uh, my base is more uh, unitarian. You can play any style of music with it. I went to passive pickups this, this year, uh, front pickup, back pickup, overall tone knob, user friendly. Bass players don't mess with knobs. <laughs> so you turn it on. Uh, it's good to go. Yeah, that's what, press it and forget it. Nice. So. I would say that's one thing good about working with Dean Guitars. It's just uh, they specifically ask the artists exactly what they want and all the little details. And uh, apparently you came up with a really, really awesome one. Well, they ask the right questions, but more importantly, they listen to the questions, the answers, I should say. So, yeah, they asked the right questions, and, and I told them, and they did exactly what I asked them to do. And every time, it comes out the same. This is my, th they're always surprising me. This one, I just had the feathers with a peace pipe. Uh, uh, the first one just had the feathers. This one, they didn't even tell me they were putting the feather down here. That was. You, you like it? I love it. Love it. It was a surprise. They, they always have a surprise too. It seems always. like which I, whoever I talk to, any of the artists, they always they're always surprised by something. Sometimes they think their um, their guitar or their bass or their drum is not ready yet, and then they come to NAMM and it's it's right there. It's like there you go. I'm gonna hand it to you as a gift or yeah. you like special touches like this. That yeah, I love that. And they're, and they're very, not just with the artists that are with Dean, but for everybody, their off the rack stuff is all playable. And as we've talked before, my whole goal is to make sure that there is a base that's affordable and playable where a parent can go out, buy the base, not get killed, not have to take a mortgage out, and it's playable and the child can learn to see learn if he has an affinity. You get, if you go spend 500 bucks and you get a cheese cutter base, the kid's gonna throw it down because it's too hard to play. He may or may not have the talent. You'll never find out on that base. Dean is approaching it the right way. When I first signed with a company, they When said, was that? Remember? Six, seven years ago. Oh, so it's been a while. Yeah. Um, I had them send me their lowest line, most inexpensive bass, and I played it. That was the determining factor for me because it was a playable instrument. You could play it from beginning all the way through 
your career if you chose to. If you chose to upgrade, Dean's got upgraded bases you could go to. But that one base could take you throughout your entire career.